Hello you beautiful people, welcome back to Like Boys Video. Today we are going to be talking about the new character, or the old character that's been revamped in Gagamaru. Now, if we jump into team and jump into the player himself, we are going to see that, as you can see, well, as you can see, I haven't maxed it, give me a second. Give me a second, there we go, we have now maxed Gin Gagamaru. So, Gagamaru is now level 100 for us, and this is what he looks like. Uh, yep, we are going to do a training session, don't worry. But, this is what Gagamaru looks like, and if we actually open his details, you're going to be able to see that he has 7.5% growth stats on everything, as well as 35% on physical and 30, sorry, 37 on physical and 37 on kicking. Super, super, super awesome. Super awesome, in fact. Now, we predicted that Honda was coming out this week or next week, right? And it seems that the game has decided that they're not going to release Honda, or maybe we still get Honda, but they've given us Gagamaru with Honda stats. Again, I, I, I mentioned this on a previous video, this is a brand new character in the sense that JP doesn't have this, only Global has this. JP stars a physical Gagamaru. We've ha we're the only people that have had this sort of conversion. Um... So, where we should have got Honda, we've ended up getting Gagamaru, which I think is a really good thing, because it means that even as a free-to-play, like, my free-to-play account has a little 65 Gagamaru, I now have this version in 65, because of it. Uh, I would have had to pull uh, Honda, like, from scratch. So, it's, it's lessening the burden on the amount of pulls that we've had to do, which is a giant W. A giant W. And on my on my whale account, I already had this at level one hundred. I just never committed the stakes because I didn't feel I didn't see the value in him, so never commit the stakes to him. Now, as you can see with the black red, he is worth the stakes. So we've now committed the stakes to him. This is a giant, giant, giant W from PWC, as well as the fact that I think that what they've done with his stats are great. You've got twenty, you've got twenty percent physical, thirty percent kicking. You've got training rate, and then you've got this, which is just utter bonkers. Absolutely love this. Sure, we could have had bonus as well. Why not throw certainly some bonus on there, make this really crazy? But um, no, the reality is this is more than enough, and the fact that we got the black red as well is ridiculously good. So we have a crazy kick support right now, and I would say one of the best kick supports in the game. Uh, if only they buffed Nagi to look a bit more like this, that'd be really nice as well. But super, super, super good unit. Um, a quick rundown, um, whether or not I recommend you get it. I do recommend you get Gagin. I do, I really do recommend you go get Gagamaru. I don't know if there's going to be a character coming out that's going to be quite to this level for a while still. Um, PWC is definitely moving very differently to the way that JP has been moving. Um, giving us the movie cards early you know, we've got access to Black Reds ahead of time. We shouldn't have had any Black Reds until Baro. Baro's still a week away, and we've got our second Black Red, and we've got a Black Red in kicking, of all places. So, it's it's definitely making me think, do we even need the Baro as much now that we've got this card? But, you know, we'll see, we'll, we'll see when the week rolls around and it comes time to sort of check it out. But, guys, this is a phenomenal card phenomenal and one that i do really recommend people get into and hopefully even you free to plays i'm really hoping you actually have like just a couple of copies lying around because you've ended up pulling him as a free unit because he he, he does get summoned a lot so it's always nice when they revamp revamp and buff existing cards because it means that even the free to play players can sort of stay relevant with it for the most part this is a giant 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 w from pwc so i'm actually super super happy with that um, and as I said, I do recommend people pull into that. Looking at the scouts, I will quickly go over them. This is a phenomenal card for you free to plays. I do really recommend free to play, and I guess people that are like hitting, say, 40, 50k units, this is a good card to buff you. If you're sort of hitting into the high 80s, 90s, potentially even 100s, this is not the card for you anymore. Like, at that point, you've outgrown this card. So, um, just as a heads up, like, I wouldn't get more than one copy, I wouldn't go crazy for this. I would try to max skin where you can. Um, but in saying that, actually, I say try to max skin. He's not going anywhere. He's sticking around. So maybe it's better. Your best use of gems is probably still this banner here. And trying to get this card up to 100. Um, or, if not, this card to 100. Um, they're probably still your best bets. but Because the limited cards are disappearing in a month. So, actually, yeah, I take that back. Go spend it on the limited cards. But yeah, dude, it's an absolute W. Um, quick video on 
on that. And I guess the next thing we'll do is do a training video. So stay tuned and I will put a training video together for Mr. Gaga Maru. And we will record our first one because why not? It's the first one of the day. Uh, we will go and do a training and I'll see you all in a sec. Bye.